Before we start this episode, you guys, I just wanted to make a couple comments. For the first comment, I just wanted to give a big shout out to my shop sponsor, Core Motive. Thank you so much, David, for you know making this deal happen, uh, working behind the scenes to make this happen for me, man. Uh, this guy, you know, has really done a lot of the footwork uh, to make this wide body happen. So thank you so much, man. I really appreciate it. Um, the second thing is. Um, I didn't really necessarily get all the shots I wanted for this episode. Um, I basically kind of had to work with what I could get. I wanted to like take some of the uh, bits and pieces of the white body out of the box and kind of show you guys a little bit more. And I also kind of wanted to put it around the car just a little bit to kind of get like an idea of what it's going to look like uh, for like before and after. But I wasn't able to do that. So like I said, it's all right. And we work with what we had. And uh, I'm just excited that we're even able to do this, you guys. Thank you guys so much for supporting me. It's taken a lot to get here. And please, if you guys can do so, help me out and subscribe, you guys. The channel is almost at 2,000 subscribers. I want to do a giveaway every time we hit a subscriber goal from 2,000 to 3,000 to 5,000, etc. So every time we hit a goal, you guys, I would like to do a giveaway like I've been doing in the past, you guys. So please help me out. Share this video. Tell your friends and subscribe to the channel. Thank you and enjoy this vlog. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the vlog. Today's vlog, as you guys can tell by the title, it is a really big episode today. I was finally able to get my hands on a Pandem wide body kit for the GR86. Oh my gosh, you guys. I've always wanted a wide body. I thought I was gonna have a wide body for the Lexus, but it just didn't happen. So. Going into this car, when I saw the Cusco wide body for this car, oh my god, I freaking fell in love with this car before I even made my decision to buy the car. And so that is one of the main reasons I got this car, is so we can wide body it. And let me tell you something, we got really lucky on this, and I'll, t I'll, I'll tie in more with that later on. But right now, I'm headed to LTMW in El Monte, um, where they have the kit, so I can kind of hopefully show it to you guys. I've never been there before. This is my first time there. Um, I'm driving on Angels Forest Highway right now from work, and uh, it's pretty fun, considering it has a lot of curves and it's definitely canyon. Um, but I've never been on this road before, uh, so it's definitely um, interesting. Uh, to go through the roads right now. I literally have nobody in front of me and I'm like been on track mode the whole time So I'm having a little bit of fun definitely like always you guys I'll tap back in with you when we get a little bit closer to LTFW So so excited to show you guys the kid. I can't wait. See you guys in a bit <laughs> So I'm a couple minutes away from LTMW and let me tell you I went through I guess I went through Angels Forest Highway, right? But it turns into Angels Crest Highway and I've always heard about that highway and That was my first time running it and holy crap It was fun <laughs> It was fun. It had a lot of turns a lot of uh, really tight uh, corners and really good to like I guess if anything test your skill like a little bit but I will say like oncoming traffic was so freaking scary like there was like trucks that were coming onto my side of the road on a corner and the corner was already tight like oh like I could just imagine why there would might be like so many like crashes up there spin outs and stuff like that like I'd say definitely make sure you have your 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 stuff together on your car before going up there. You could easily mess up or somebody could easily mess you up. And uh, other than that, it was super fun. I, I enjoyed it for my going through my first time. All right. Damn. Look at all these freaking, oh my gosh. That intersect's a little dusty. I don't know if I'm supposed to be parking here, but this is what we're gonna do. Finally here, next to this fine ass wide body C8. 
Liberty Walk with some BBS wheels. Oh my gosh. Jeez. Um, Alright, so just like last time, you guys, I'm not going to record until like I feel like I have the okay to do so. You know, I'm gonna go in there and introduce myself, look at the kit, and then probably chop it up a little bit. You know, talk about a couple things that um, I, I want to know or want to, want to be done to the car or whatever like that. So I'll see you guys in a moment. Alright, I came to see the kit right now, and <laughs> damn, this shit looks so I'm cool. I'm not ever going to meet your wife, man. Look how big the fender is. The fender is huge. About three to four inches, I believe. Oh my gosh, you guys. I can't believe low-key this is going down right now. Honestly, it's still pretty surreal, but once I actually see everything really, like, starting to go on and everything like that, like, I'm pretty sure, like, then it'll really start to settle in. Yeah? Not as whack as your fucking GS, homie. <laughs> he has a pretty clean one, actually. They got all the parts in there, just laying. And here I am, like, oh, KW. Oh, Beamer. Oh, tires. Oh, wheels. <laughs> fucking candy store for a car guy. I told him to try to get his motor in. It looks a lot better. Yeah, but it's more expensive and it takes more time. Yeah, and it takes money, man. Well, we don't got. Oh, you're right. You're right. We we on YouTube, but uh, you know YouTube pays us 120 a month. So come on, HBO, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Netflix, where you at, man? Yeah. Damn, is this really for sale though? Yes. Dude, you guys, this G80 is. On the trip, oh my God. So if you guys are looking for a G80, this is for sale. Wagon is crazy. All right, so what would you guys think of this wheel if it was on the freaking 86? So this wheel uh, is made by MK, which is Long's freaking wheel company. And damn, it looks pretty damn clean. Especially on this wagon with the wide body. Jeez. So what would you guys think if we added these wheels onto the 86 along with the wide body? Throw down your opinions on what you guys might think. We should go with these, or should we go with some rotiforms, or what kind of wheels would you guys want to see with the uh, Panda Wide Body Kit? All right, you guys, so we're gonna head out right now. Thank you guys for your guys' hospitality uh, at LT Works, which is LTMW. Uh, they're basically Liberty Walk USA. Uh, they put all the Liberty Walk kits. Peace! They put all the Liberty Walk kits on. They've done many, many SEMA builds, you guys. So I definitely trust my car in their hands. They're gonna be installing it, uh, making sure all the fitment is correct and everything like that. So I'm really excited. Um, I know what you guys might be thinking. Oh, why don't you guys just do it yourself? Well, there's a lot that I'm still knowledgeable and I still need to learn about body kits. And there's just a lot that goes into it. So I definitely would like to work with them, especially because I've, I've kind of heard some good things about them through the grapevine. So definitely big shout out to Long. Thank you so much for also getting me this kit. Like there, I, I don't think that there is another kit here in the USA. Like literally I got the only kit. If I was to buy the kit straight from Pandem, it was gonna be like three months long. So you guys already know how logistics go when it comes to that. And I just didn't want to wait that long. So big shout out to you guys. Thank you so much for letting me purchase the kit off of you and for installing it. So the, by the time you guys see this video, it'll probably be like already a week and a half in on when I dropped off the car. So I want to say anywhere from around two to three weeks for the car to actually be done. So the next time you guys see an upload, it will be with the kit already on you guys. So I can't wait to show you guys. Um, I've been hinting at this big purchase for so freaking long you guys. Um, I'm not gonna say how much uh, the kit was just yet, um, but I will do like a numbers thing to kind of show you guys in the next uh, vlog when we come back and we see the kit on for the first time you guys. So I'm so excited. If you guys can do me a big favor, please give me a big thumbs up on this video as well as a subscribe if you guys want to see how this build is going to be going. We still got so much planned, right? So it's not just a wide body, but um, please help us out you guys. Um, th this, this is the goal. This is the passion. This is 
what we're here for, you know, and um, I just want to say thank you to everybody that has been supporting me so far, so thank you guys so much. Um, I know this video might be really, really short, but I just wanted to showcase you guys what I've been kind of working on and what's in the works, so um, with that being said, make sure you guys live long and prosper. I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.